Reporting from the Q Television Center with news from your region, we are the first for news that matters to you locally, regionally, and nationally. This is QTV News. Good afternoon. This is the news on LifestyleNewry.com, brought to you by QTV. I'm Bob Huggins. There's controversy over the proposal that a health centre in Newry should be managed by the private sector. Health Minister Edwin Poots has directed the Department of Health to seek private finance for the new centre, as well as for another in Lisburn. SDLP MLA Conal McDevitt says the centre should be maintained by the NHS for the best outcome and value for money for taxpayers. A fire in Banbridge is being treated as suspicious. The blaze in Riley Park was reported at around 7pm last Wednesday, the 12th of June. Emergency services attended the scene and the fire was extinguished. Two men were seen running away from the flats around this time. Licensed premises in Newry were burgled over the weekend. Officers on early morning patrol discovered evidence of a forced entry at the premises. Two men aged 19 and 20 were arrested shortly after in the New Street area. And finally, there are traffic concerns in Darkley Village in County Armagh. The village sits between the upper and lower Darkley roads. A lack of signage on either side of the village means motorists don't know when to slow down. Local councillor Darren McNally is appealing to the road service to introduce speed ramps. Well, that's the news. To stay up to date, visit LifestyleNewry.com and listen to Q Radio on 100.5 FM. Good afternoon.